I'm, I'm curious. I, I want to ask questions, but you I don't want to like don't overstep my boundaries. You know what I mean? No, go oh my ahead. god, do it. Do it. If it's too much, I'll tell you that I can't answer. Yeah, 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 please. Just tell me, because I can get a bit too nosy sometimes. Yeah, go but ahead. Right now, right? Uh-huh. What is the most like... When it comes to your treadmill thing... Do you feel like tired after or before? Mostly. Both. <laughs> Okay, never mind. <laughs> Both. Actually, I think I think I was like, I'm I'm motivated to do it, but I I like I got like uh I don't know if you know I I, I have a condition. I'm sure you kind of know, but like I I have a, I have a chronic illness uh and mm -hmm. I have to be on treatment for it. So I take uh I get like blood plasma every week. Uh, mm. and it makes me, it doesn't, it feels, it makes me feel really sick for like two, two, three days. And then I'm fine for a few days. And then the next week starts and I have to take it again. So, uh, I just get frustrated cause like, I want to do more on the treadmill, but then I have to take my treatment and then it makes me feel like shit mm. and then I can't do it. And then I get mad at myself and then I'm like, <sighs> you know, I feel like it resets my progress. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's what I was about to say. Like, usually, that's one thing you gotta get out of your head. Okay, you're not resetting anything. The fact that you're already trying is already good. Like you're standing up there, you're doing it. That's already good. Because the mentality that usually makes you exhausted afterwards is like, you feel like, oh shit, I did so much better yesterday. Yeah. I resetted my progress. What the fuck? And then you get like tired. Just remember, like, that is genuinely just your subconscious. You got this. Mm. Walking little okay, by little is better than not thumbs. walking at all. Something That's like that. That's true. This one. That's yeah. True. I I'm just glad I could do it now, because I used to... Oh my god, it was pretty bad. I mean, yeah, you couldn't yeah. walk. I couldn't walk. Mm. Uh, I think, like, when I, when I had my walker and I would try to walk, I was, like, shuffling like a zombie from, like, a movie. <laughs> Yeah, you would go peep and it would be like... <laughs> it'd take a peep. long, long time. It'd take a long time. <laughs> and like, I had, I had this thing where it's like... Uh, when you, when, when you're like in a hospital for a long time... You get mm -hmm. muscular atrophy, which means like your muscles like waste away and you like lose muscle. And then you can mm -hmm. develop something with your legs where it's like your feet. You can't really like flex your foot. And you have like pointed feet like all the time because you can't like flex it you can't like make mm -hmm. you know and then it's like i couldn't like stand on my tiptoes at all because i had no muscle mm -hmm. uh. so like i couldn't get on my tippy toes i i i couldn't like when i was in bed my foot was always like down and it's like i think it's called like drop foot or whatever and mm. it, it takes a long time to get those muscles back because like they just like go away you know, and it can happen yeah. to like any part of your body, and it, it it happens a lot with people that are bedridden for a long time or like have to stay in bed for a long time. And uh, I sometimes I would be like in the hospital for like five six months, where it's like I'm like mm. in bed all the time. And then now I haven't been in the hospital for a long time because I get I get seen at my house, so I have a nurse that comes to my house. Mm. And uh, I recently like moved. So, like, I have more space and I have, like, a lot of stuff here. And, uh, I, I've been, like, working on, like, walking around. And, and now I could finally, like, walk around my house. Very <laughs> slow. But I could do it. And I couldn't do it. Like, I think, like, in my old place where I lived with my parents, like, I hadn't seen my house in, like, years. Because I haven't been, I wasn't able to, like, walk around it. And now I could walk around my house. And it's really nice. Yay! It's, it's really, really nice. But it's like, it's frustrating, like, having to go through all that stuff and, like, everything, like, hurts all the time. <laughs> I get it, though. I get yeah. it. Yeah. It's, uh, it's a lot. I don't really, like... Like, if people ask me in chat about it, like, I talk about it, but, like, I, I don't really like to be like, Hey, guys! It's me, Iron Mouse. Um, I'm, I'm sick, and I have this. <gasps> you know what I mean? That, I get it. I get it. I, I, I mean, mean, I just want to be an anime girl and not think about any of this shit. I, I totally get I think that part I get as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
it's just it's perplexing because like i don't know especially in the beginning i'm i'm like this is the iron mouse be introduced the and you're like she's she's sick i mean yeah i'm like yeah, considerably yes she's like she's in bed i'm like yeah yeah and she's like why is she all like talking <laughs> and i said you know what i have no idea <laughs> Yeah, uh-huh, because people, when people think like, oh, chronic disease, they think either you're dying or like, they think the worst, like, oh, whoa, she's yeah. so sick, she, do, she shouldn't be on the internet, it's like, what the fuck? Exactly. Yeah. I don't know, but like, to me, most fun. people that are on the internet are, <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing, like, honestly, so, like, this is me being super honest, like, I get really awkward, like, because online, people can see anything the way they want it, right? And sometimes yeah. I, f like, I've, like, my, I'm also, like, not the healthiest. Like, it took me so long to be open about it because I didn't want people to know me as, like, oh, that person that is sick. Like, totally get it. Totally understand. Right? Mm -hmm. And the thing is, like, my family, like, I'm not sick because of, like, myself. It's more of a genetic thing. So because I've been raised with people that are also, like, genetically, like, affected as well, I've always been raised to be like, the least, like the last thing people who are sick wants to have is being treated with like. Yeah. Pity. Oh my God. Thank you. <laughs> Thank like, you. Like they just so want to be treated like everyone else, and like, cause my mom, like she has autoimmune. So mm -hmm. when people know that and they're like, oh, oh, like like you know what I mean? Like it's yep. nice. Like they mean well, but my mom hates it. Yup. So I've always been raised to be like, oh, just talk to them like a normal person and just like do whatever, just. You know, be normal because they don't want to be treated like oh you you poor thing so yeah. i always just talk to people that way but on the internet if i do that they'll be like oh my god you're so insensitive i'm like oh. i don't mean to just like, 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 what like, am oh, i supposed well, I to hope you get well soon it's just like Ugh. yeah that's what my mom said it's like like she's like i know she, they mean well when they say like i hope you get well soon but now i'm just reminded of it and i don't want to think about it it's like i don't know oh, how like, to tell okay. them <laughs> How do we tell them? You're, tell you're them? preaching the mouse's choir, my god. I totally, I totally understand. <laughs> Trust me. I don't I don't mind answering questions. Like if somebody asks me a question, like if you ask me a question, I don't mind talking about it. But like the last thing I ever want is to be the sick girl online and uh, yeah. I feel like a lot of times like people will <laughs> I've like seen like comments like on YouTube where it's like, oh all shit. <laughs> All she does is talk about her sickness. It's like, bitch, tell me you've never watched my streams or never seen me without telling me. Because, like, everybody who watches me knows that the last thing I want is for people to pity me. I don't want anybody to feel bad for me. I don't want anybody to, like, make a big deal about all this shit that's going on. Like, just treat me like a normal person. Because... Mm -mm. Please. That's the thing. Like, I don't know. I feel like... One thing, though, I'd say is, like... Do not type get like, well people... soon in my chat! <laughs> <laughs> That's why, like... I don't know. I got, like, a little bit, like... Oh, I don't know how to react now. Because I do know that, like, not everyone is like my mom. My mom is a very tough lady. So, I guess that's why she's like... Don't you dare look at me with pity in your eyes. No! <laughs> Bro, I was like, okay, she sounds mother. just like my mom. And my mom raised me like that. And I'm like that. <laughs> Like, that's the thing. I was like, I don't know. Like, I don't know what to do sometimes. Because I don't want to get the... Give off the wrong impression, Bro, you know? my mom... Because people be speculating. My mom... And I'm like... You know what? If I... Like, I, I can't even cry in front of my mom. Because my mom would be like... Anything... Anything that happens to me. Anything I say. Whatever. Like, I could be like... Recovering from like... The worst infection where I, I'm about to die. And I'll be like... Feeling sorry for myself. Or like... I'll, I'll say... I'll say something where it's like... Ah, it's so difficult. She'll be like... Why are you being so stupid? You're alive, right? <gasps> you need to be happy. You can't be sad. I don't want you to cry. Don't ever cry. Don't ever cry for anybody. You're alive. Be happy. You're fine. And I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> my god, the cultural differences. I don't Hell like, no, I think crying my... is good. Okay, I will always say my crying is good. My mom says that crying but... is 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 bad and that crying is like a disservice to to all of them. My mom like <laughs> my mom has issues. Man. Jesus. My mom thinks that crying is... Like, if I ever cry in front of my mom, my mom gets so pissed at me, it's not even funny. She'll be like, why are you depressed for? Why are you cry? Why are you sad? Huh? 
Why? Why would you be sad? You're alive. You're breathing. You're breathing, right? So you have to be happy and smile. And I'm like, Ugh. But mother, the Miami Dolphins lost. I don't know what to do. <laughs> We, I watched this the clip in chat of this skit from SNL where like um they 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 do they do the whole like Latina mom like thing and everything that they said <laughs> same, some sh the same shit my mom would say where it's like one time my daughter was oppressed and I told her to stop doing that and she did. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's my mom too. Mom I'm gonna mom. lie that I understand, <laughs> but the way my mom raised me was like. This is something she always says. It's like, if I'm really, really sad and I'm like, so sad, like, I'm debilitated. My mom would be like, okay, you have three days. You have three days to cry and be emotional. After three days, if you don't get your shit together, I will smack you. Damn, your mom so... lets you, gives you three days? <laughs> yeah, my mom gives me a breathing room. What Let's the go. fuck? <laughs> my mom doesn't give me shit. <laughs> my mom gives me three whole days. She's like, yeah, cry about it. Holy shit. But after three days, if <laughs> I see a tear out of your days. eyes. <laughs> I wish I, I had know. three days. Oh my god. The second, if my mom were catching me crying, my mom is like, why are you so stupid? <laughs> why are you acting like that? Why are you doing this? You are a woman. You cannot do this. Women do not cry. <laughs> oh my god. Who, who cries then? Turtles? No one. You're not allowed to cry. Crying is good. Okay, I will I will say no to that one. To be fair, I am a crybaby though, and my mom knows that. So if she goes like, stop crying, I'd cry. My so I guess that's like the middle ground we found, but... Crying is good. Sometimes, sometimes you just I need to have a good cry. I think crying is good too. I think crying is good too, but I just can't do it in front of my mom because she'll get mad at me. <laughs> she'll get mad at me. She'll get so upset at me. One time... I think I think uh, somebody clipped something and I cried and, she, and my dad showed it to her. And my mom was like, I need to talk to you. And I'm like, oh, what do you need to talk to me about? She goes, I saw what you did. And I'm like, what did I do? She was like, I saw on the internet. You cried. You cried on the internet and people saw you crying. And I'm like, yeah, I, I got emotional. And she's like, you can't do that. And I was like, what do you mean? She was like, do you want people to think that you are sad? <laughs> and I'm like, what? Like you are not sad. Are you sad right now? And I'm like, I'm not sad. And she's like, okay, well, you have no reason to be sad because you're alive and you have a job. Girl, that is that is intense. She's like, you're is... alive. You have a job. You oh make God. money. You have a house. You have no reason to be sad. And I'm like, oh my God, it's okay. I promise I'll never cry on the internet again. And I was like, Mom, I think I was happy crying. She was like, Well, if you're happy crying, that's different. But you can only do that for like. A minute, and it has uh, to be, and you need to tell everybody that you're happy. And I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> Ooh. Guys, my mom is a wonderful lady. Don't think that she's, but it's just the way that she was raised, man. Like, mm -mm. it's just old fashioned things. It's nothing I, bad. I my mom it. is a very compassionate person, and she cares about me a lot. I mean, she raised me, and she had to deal with all my bullshit. Of course, she's great. It's just she was just raised in a in a time. Where people saw crying as weakness, and it was weak, and it was, and it's like, oh my god, dude, that's that's like what I totally agree with that because, like, I've told a lot of stories about my parents too. Like, they're not bad; they're just like strict and traditional and yep. everything. Cause, yep. like, I keep saying it's like I don't hate them, and like I saw, I did see some comments where it's like, it's amazing that she can still love her mom even after everything they, she's done to her, blah blah. blah. And I was like. Because I get it. Like, my mom was raised worse. Like, I... I trust me. Like, she's like, doing her best. Okay, I get it. Listen, people that say that don't know the suffering that our parents had to do. I, I, I as an adult mm. now, I know all the shit my parents went through. Because when I was a kid, my parents never told me anything about their lives. And then the second I, I, you know, we moved away and I got... Now I'm older and stuff like that. My mom just unloaded everything from her life. And I still can't believe she's still alive after everything she told me. And I'm mm, just like, it, everything it. makes sense. You. It makes so much sense as to why she is the way she is. And I don't hold anything against her. I don't, I don't hate her. I, I love her. And I understand that she's just working with everything that was given to her. And everything that was taught to her. And she's just working with what life dealt 
her and I understand and I recognize that some of the stuff, although to an outsider it would seem fucked up, but to us it makes it to me it makes sense and I understand and it's fine. Hmm. You know what I mean? I think I mean I will say that crying is good and you shouldn't feel pressured about it, you know? Let your emotions yeah, out. I think so. Like I everything agree. else. I agree. But I also think your mom is a great woman just because you know, like, look at how you turned out, you know? <sighs> The apple doesn't fall too woman. far from the tree. Something, something. You're an amazing person, so... It's like tough love, but I can tell it's true. It's like... It, she's not just like lying to your face. It's true. It's true. It's just, yeah. you know, just think about it. Like, my mom has been through a lot in her life. I'm not gonna say what she, what happened to her, but... Some pretty fucked up shit. And then, she, she has a kid, and it's me. And she has a kid that's... She basically has defective merchandise. That's me. <laughs> no! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I make I make fucked up jokes. I make fucked up jokes. I make fucked up jokes. Girl, I make fucked up I mean, jokes. I make fucked up jokes. I can't laugh at your fucked up. I'll, I'll just now you have now you have to deal with my silence. Yeah, it's that's what you get for right. making fucked up jokes. You gotta deal it's with okay. silence. If Mouse is on the on the shelf on, on the supermarket, she'll still up chart. So it's okay. <laughs> Girl. I think, and just think about it. She had to deal with all this bullshit. And it's just like, of course she's the way she is. <laughs> ah! I can't, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> she was like, oh, she was... <laughs> My mom was probably like, yeah, I can't wait to have a family. Then she has me and she's like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Say it that way. What happened? Girl, I swear, the more, the more dark jokes you make, the more silence it's gonna be. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you right now, girl. Oh I ain't gonna sugarcoat God. it. Bro, you better get used to it, yo. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. It, it's just it's just how I deal with stress and stuff. Yeah. It's okay. It's just, it's just you know, on stream. I can't yeah. react to that. <laughs> oh, yes, you can. <laughs> yeah, what do you mean? <laughs> I'll have the fear will kill me before, before Bro, anything else. I, I, I told okay. a dark joke in front of Haruka and she burst out laughing. And it, was, and it made me laugh. It was so great. She laughed so hard. <laughs> Seriously, right. Mochi. I, I got I'm on Mouse's so stream the other day. Of that. Oh, sorry? Oh, I'll oh, sorry. Continue first. Oh, I got on Mouse's stream le last time and she was like, Hello, Mel. Did you know one day we're all gonna die? <laughs> all of us! We're gonna die! <laughs> and Holy there's shit. nothing and true? we're dead! I'm like, nice! I mean, I'm just being honest, you know? <laughs> it was just a great introduction. Like, hey, what's up? Hey, we're gonna I die. just think we just need to be, like, like be honest with ourselves. And, and it shouldn't be taboo to talk about stuff like that. Because we're all gonna it's die true. anyway. It's true, it's true. Okay, but, like, what was the context? Nothing. There was no context, I just... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Us know. <laughs> I just wanted to remind I... people. <laughs> Thank you for the reminder. <laughs> it brings joy to my spirit. She's helpful like that. One it's day good. I will be a spirit. Girl, girl, what? I swear I'm gonna prolong a side. Like I, I'm so good at prolonging silence to the point that it makes someone uncomfortable. Girl, don't make me do it. Girl. girl. Did, girl, just do it. Did, did you know that Mouse is gonna have an amazing IRL debut, but it's gonna be super oh my awkward? God. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> oh yeah, I... I told people that when I die, I was gonna donate my body to science, and, and some medical student was gonna work on me and be like, Oh shit, this was Iron Mouse, and then I'd be like, my fucked up face reveal. <laughs> She's so quiet! <laughs> it's gonna be okay, Moji. I'm surprised she hasn't even left. I'm surprised she Bro, if left. we're not laughing, we'd be crying. That's true. You got a choice to make. Oh my god, guys, look at my supermarket. It's so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. 